Hello friends, welcome to Planning P6. Hope you are doing well. Today I am here with a topic of how we can see the schedule percent complete or performance percent complete in the WBS. As I have received too many comments about this topic that the Primavera while we are calculating or updating the Primavera, our WBS where performance and schedule percent complete is not showing either the activities are showing first of all i will clear your concepts about how the primavera p6 calculated the schedule percent and performance percent complete up to the wbs level and how it is calculating the up to the activity level so there are these both are calculated by different ways let's move forward and understand it so I have created a sample project here. If you see here is our project schedule percent complete activities and WBS. As you are watching here the performance other percentages are showing uh, for the units percent and for the activity percent and physical is only for the activities and for the units percent complete it is showing in every schedule. So as you are watching here I have just taken a L and gas schedule for the compression facility and I am now doing it as a sample project so here you can see i have just applied the actuals over there after applying the actuals you can see here now as our project start date was first of january i have started as it is and the completion is second of october now forecasted completed before it was 26th of august like that so for the activities it is showing but the roll up is not showing over there here you can see the schedule percent complete for the activities for the activities the formula is data date minus baseline start over divided by baseline finish minus baseline start. You can create this formula in Excel as well, but to see in Primavera it is automatically calculating. There is no need. But for the schedule percent complete at the WBS level is equal to plant value or plant value cost is equal to budget at completion. So how the Primavera is calculating the schedule percent or performance percent complete at the WBS level and plant value or budget at completion. So here now for the performance is also there is a different formula just to show your clear your concept I have written only one formula. So now we are going to do it. So here first of all what you have to do some of the planning engineer when we are writing replying their queries in the comment section or somewhere on other social media platform uh, on the whatsapp email the, what they are doing they start doing in the updated schedule and it is not showing for the schedule percent complete what you have to do first of all we have to see our project as you see here my project is there i have created this project for especially for the activities and wbs performance and schedule percent complete with the same tutorial you can do for the performance as well so here in the activities first of all we will go and see our assigned baseline first of all we have to remove our baseline from here baseline from here so i am removing this baseline okay baseline is removed now it is our updated schedule whatever so i will also do the maintain baseline i will restore the baseline because while i am restoring it will restore over there where you assigned so it will be restored and i will see we have to do for the baseline if you are in mid of the project so you have to do for the baseline separately and for the update schedule separately the same step so i will restore the baseline here okay i want to restore it so baseline has been restored now now if i see in the projects here the projects my pro under the projects i have created this baseline is now restored so i will go for the first of all for the updated schedule so now i will go into the resources in the resources you see now we have the resources limited resources which are the man hours and now the quantities all are the quantities and man hours so these man hours are calculated and calendar which i have assigned is 7 12 for the schedule percent complete it is calculated by the plant value over budget at completion so that's why we need a cost over there we know uh, or we understand there is no assigned cost but we need to do for some activity either you will create a new resource here new resource just a dummy resource for the cost and now assign 
वन वन यूनिट इट विल टेक द सेम वेटेज एज इट इज असाइन बाय द यूर रिसोर्सेज सो हाउ द फॉर द वेटेज पर्पज यू कैन सी आवर दिस टूटोरियल वेटेज इन प्राइमा वीरा पी सिक्स इफ यू सी हेयर इट इज अबाउट अपलोडेड फाइव मंथस अगो सो दिस वेटेज इज टूटोरियल यू कैन सी हेयर एंड ऑल्सो सर्च ऑन यूट्यूब प्लानिंग पी सिक्स एंड यू कैन सी टू मैनी टूटोरियल ओवर देयर सो नाउ हेयर वी विल डू विद टू डिफरेंट मैथड्स first of all we will change only for the existing resource like this as a main or resource so i want to buy, buy the same so what i will do i will here go to the unit and prices unit and prices after removing the baseline so unit and prices i will write here the standard rate is equal to 1 what i will do i will do here the standard rate is equal to 1 and now i will go into the tools and in the tools you can see here the reso rec uh, recalculate the assignment cost so i will do it okay so here recalculate successfully recalculated okay now i will go there in the activities now you can see here it is automatically calculated how much is that and how much is that if you see here the plan value cost is shown and budget at completion is also shown for the both of them it is calculated by the same like the per, for the performance actual value earned value cost and then total budget cost so it will now you can see here the performance percent complete and schedule percent complete and plan value cost and earned value cost is showing over there for the entire schedule up to the wps level if i collapse to any level maybe level 3 apply and okay now you can see here up to the wp level it is shown so but whenever you will doing for the updated schedule it is not showing in the baseline so while you will assign let's assign again the baseline project maintain baseline i will add convert other project okay i will go to here and just take this baseline to okay initial planning baseline close and then assign the baseline current project i will assign just and primary also the same okay so now you can see here again it will go out because this this plan percent complete and these are it is referenced from the baseline so that's why it is we need to do also as a baseline some planning engineers are doing in the in this updated schedule as in the updated schedule we have updated this is equal to 1 cause of not doing in the baseline it is showing like that so i will do here again i will go and remove the baseline okay remove the baseline okay okay so baseline is removed and it is coming rolling up all of the values over there so i will go again to the projects and here i will just uh, maintain and restore the baseline to just ignore the copy of the schedule okay and here is our baseline what i will do i will do here with the other method open project i will open the baseline for example the same baseline same method so here might be we can assign a new resource as a cost or we can we have option to do with the same so i will do here with first of all we will do with the same okay activities and this resource resources okay one and i will go to the recalculate assignment cost here recalculate okay go to the activities budget at completion is showing but this is not updated the schedule percent complete and performance percent complete is equal now if you see here it's rolling up over there for example this one you can see here you can see here because it has a zero progress for the performance it's approved baseline with zero progress for the performance also and for the Uh, performance percent and schedule percent complete and plan value cost that's why it's zero and budget at completion is showing over there this is one method and if i assign this baseline again let's just assign and then do open the project again go to the project open the project not the baseline open project over there and now i will maintain and assign baseline maintain baseline add convert other project the same one i will just take this baseline okay and then initial planning baseline if you did not select this one is also okay okay project assign baseline i will assign the baseline it's one is also enough but i will in a good practice i will assign the primary baseline as well now you can see here just refresh your schedule it will now showing 
everything so the what is the second option let's just do a copy of that project this project control c and just do the control v okay i want the same copy okay and okay now here we have the copy of 16 we just named it 16 b okay here you can see schedule and performance percent complete open it open that project after the opening now what i will do i will just assign here the baseline for that resources i will remove this one price unit you if you edit here it will not take from here you have to go from in the bottom layer unit and prices and then change from here okay after the changing just I will go to the tools and recalculate assignment cost okay recalculate yes recalculate it is now you can see here again the zero for the weightages we have as I show you another tutorial on it very detailed tutorial you can watch over there so what I will do I will go here in the resources and add a new resource okay I want a new resource like uh, this one okay I will just say here cost whatever you can write it dummy what's name you want you can do it i will just write here the material and here maybe whatever the currency for the uh, for the unit of my year you can you have option to modify it or write your own so finish it this is the material what i will do i will just assign here the material cost is material and i will mention here the standard rate is equal to one and now tools recalculate assignment cost not necessary now because we did not assign this cost over there so i will move back to this one is equal to zero manners or manners whatever so i will go here to the activities and i will expand all the activities now what i will do i will go to the resources and here this is milestone okay in this i will just add a resource i will assign a resource to the all activities so select it after the selecting now assign search the cost 54 and we will assign this resource over there now you can see here we have assigned if before assigning if you are assigning the cost for the times uh, for the safe side you need to do the recalculate assignment cost for this one other than this it is okay now you can see here our budget at completion is showing because of the our weightages and some factors we have just assigned as it is it is whatever the weightages was assigned whatever the units were assigned we did it because of that it is showing here the cost difference but this was not our now our today's topic our today's topic is how to roll up the schedule percent complete performance percent complete or the plant value cost budgeted completion for the performance factor and the for the schedule percent complete it is rolling up over there you have to you can assign the dummy resources as well i will just here now filter the resources to the current project resources if you see here our cost resources there before assigning if we mention the price per unit it will be automatically recalculated by the prima vera p6 or if you have any doubt then you have to have, you will need to do the recalculate assignment cost over there in this concept we are doing separate for the baseline and separate for the updated schedule but in the new project when you are doing to just to be the safe side to neglect this issue when you are preparing the schedule assign a small cost maybe 0 0.001 one or whatever you want you can do give a little cost over there maybe 0 0.0001 percent or whatever you want you can but your schedule should have a cost minimum cost because some of the values some of the calculations are done by the software on behalf of the cost like this schedule percent complete and performance percent complete hopefully this tutorial is helpful for you people please like share and comment on our tutorials thanks for watching allah hafiz